Um, oh, excuse me, Mr. Johnson. Mr. Chairman, I'm the privilege. Yeah. Rabbi Gaber, would you be able to come up? Thank you. Thank you, sir, for coming tonight. And um, I stand here humble before everybody in this room this body, the administration, the public, to offer an apology to you for words that I said last night that came from my mouth, communicated, but did not intend. And while I was aiming to seek perspective, clearly I stumbled in my words and thoughts and caused pain and caused harm in our community, to you personally, and to your congregation. And for that, I am truly sorry. Again, I apologize to you. All my life, I have spent working and advancing the cause of reducing bigotry and improving his life for the rest of us. And last night, I failed. And so, uh, to everybody assembled here and to the world who's listening, I just express my to do look forward to meeting with you to talk about the question that I really meant to ask in relationship to a message that I read out that my words attributed inadvertently to you that wasn't what I had hoped to do. And to talk about those words because I need help understanding how to engage with these people and the number of positions I have to understand. So again to everybody, my humble apologies and to you sir most certainly. Thank you so much. I truly, apologize, I truly appreciate your apology and desire to meet with me, a part of the person and public, what it is now, what happened last night. I'm very grateful that you recognize the gravity of the words, how they came across, and that you want to make amends to the Jewish community, the community at large, what happened last night. Your apology and coming forward in such an honest and open way is greatly appreciated. I will no doubt. Help us to move forward and bring the community together. I want to um, thank the English community for the outpour of support last night, last night and today, hundreds of phone calls and emails and Facebook messages from every political religious and ethnic segment of the English community. It is clear that English will always remain welcoming and supportive of diversity and tolerance. Second, I want to thank the mayor and members of the assembly who reached out to me personally and a part of what happened last night. And again, I want to thank you for your apology, for your apology and I really accept it. Um, I just want to take this opportunity to express again my appreciation to the mayor and the entire assembly for their effort to solve the problems that we have with homelessness and drug abuse in the community. As I mentioned in my original statement last last night. This is a very noble cause and goes to the roots of the Jewish and American values. It is our duty, everyone in our town, and our responsibility to make sure that every person that does not have a home, we should provide them a home. And though anyone who has struggled with substance abuse, they deserve and to receive our help. Our campus, our neighborhoods, our community councils will be happy to work together with our family to find a plan that is helpful and safe for all. Thank you so much. Thank you, guys.